What's going on, y'all? We got Keaton Mitchell, ECU running back. Um, ran the second fastest uh, 40 time in the combine this year for running backs, 4.37. Um, Draft Buzz has him ranked as the 11th best running back on their board. He had 1,400 rushing yards, averaged 7.2 yards to carry, 14 rushing touchdowns, 27 receptions for 252 yards. So he put up some nice numbers. Um, rushing ability 87. They give him 82.4 out of 100. Breaking tackle 72. Receiving in hands 51. Pass blocking 22. Run blocking 50. So just the pure runner for the most part. And, um, I guess we're, we we won't expect to see too much extra from him. Um, it says his strengths. Mitchell keeps his pass low and consistently falls forward. Unlike most backs his size, Mitchell has the lateral movement and stop start ability to make defenders whiff. He has breakaway speed in the open field. He is elite as a receiver, runs routes as well as most receivers, and has natural hands, snatching the ball away from his body. They say he's elite as a receiver, but then they gave his receiving ability receiving a hands of 51. That's different. Um, contradicting. He finishes, runs well, and flashes the ability to get small and squeeze through traffic. He's equally dangerous in catch and run situations as he is taking the top off of defense. His initial burst is excellent. And he's capable of running out of a traditional setup or taking the ball lined up next to a quarterback and shotgun. Mitchell might be able to contribute as a runner with some consistency if used outside on some zone runs, but he is more likely complementary back if used pro properly. Weaknesses. He doesn't have the ability as a run blocker or the violent run after catch ability. He does not always show a burst in the box. He anticipates contact. Can get turned turn easily. I'm assuming that means you turn. I turned. Um, can get turned easily on draws and inside isolation plays. Shuffling and failing to restart momentum. Power in his cuts has been inconsistent. Tripped upon first contact. The lacks of size pops up in pass protection where Mitchell often struggles to stand up blisters. Right, let's check them out. Shout out to Digital. I think it's Digital or Digital Sports for the highlights. First and goal from the All right. Here good cut. Good Mitchell, cut. Like what I see right there. Running back kind of like, another uh, quarterback kind of like dipped in a little bit with him. There's the explosion of Mitchell. And there goes Keith okay. Mitchell. A foot race. Mitchell to the 30. They're not going to catch him. 80. I wonder if he ran track. This is what makes Mitchell so Jeez. Special. Now we just watched Devon A Shane. A Shane. He was fast too, but I don't want to discredit. Um. Jeez. I don't want to discredit Mitchell, but no competition makes some somewhat of a difference. I feel like he definitely. I feel like just from this highlight already, he looks a little faster than. That. Jeez. He looks faster than A chain, but A chain ran a faster 40, so. I don't know. I know game speed different from 40 speed, but still, I'm thinking maybe competition makes a difference. Tight ends ran crazy too. I forgot about the tight ends. Oh my gosh. Okay. Easy money. Shout out to the O line right there. The stiff form. Good move. Ooh. Mm, good run. I don't know, man. That was a nice little subtle move right there. Second and four. Good move. Mitchell breaking it over. Oh my gosh. Good night. Mitchell with a wide open gap. Mitchell to the pylon and a touchdown. Definitely some good highlights. For sure. Good patience, good patience. He was, he was trying to pick his hole, trying to see where he was going to go. That was nice. Oh my gosh. I don't know who I would say is better. I ain't going to lie. It's kind of tough. It's not a competition, but it's just I just watched them back to back and they're both speedsters. Temple kicked a field goal. Keaton Mitchell to the outside. 
guy. Keaton Mitchell with a big play. Splits defenders. 10, 5, touchdown. Great run. NCAA rules don't allow. Uh-oh. Okay, all right, QB. Oh, my gosh. Keaton Mitchell runs away from Aylers again gives it to Keaton Mitchell. Bounces it to the outside. He's going to be nice for somebody. Playing this game, they don't have any hard feelings against the guys who decided to go ahead and get into the draft. How about this Keaton Mitchell on the outside? His first carry. I'm a, hopefully, I remember his name. Watching hundreds of players, you know, I forget a lot of people's names by the time the season starts. But I want to I wanna look out for him during uh, preseason. Oh. Oh. Oh my gosh. Easy, easy money. Okay. The vid. Um. <sighs> competition is always a thing for me when I see that. You know, see the level of competition. But again, like I say, running back is a flexible position. Because if, if if they can do it, if they can do a lot, you know. Um, like if, as a running back, if you have a lot in your bag, then, you know, it's where it comes to patience, footwork, speed, break tackle ability, power. Um, you know, if you got a lot in your bag, you know, just instincts, uh, quick change of direction, whatever it is, then you could fit in almost any offense as a running back. Because at the end of the day, your job is just to run, you know. So, like, level of competition matters, but at the same time, it don't. So, it's just like. I don't know. I'm looking forward to see where he goes. Uh, I, I think uh, he got he got a lot of potential. I think fit is going to be important. I think he needs to be in a position where, you know, he not battling for a roster spot. I think, you know, where he's like third on a depth chart. And it's it, like we know for sure. So he could possibly get a you know opportunity to play, I think, for sure. But like bringing him in like as a fourth, fifth option, I think we ain't going to be able to see his full talent now. I don't know. Like, I don't know his, his drive projection. So, if he was projected to go go higher, you know, like I said, if he's third or second on the depth chart, then, he, of course, if he's first, then for sure. But um, he got a lot of potential. So, we're going to see. Like, Y'all hit the like button. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section. Subscribe. Stay tuned. Be bless. You done messed up, A.A. Ron! Ain't no need to play games. I'm cool with zeros on the stat sheet. I don't care if you knew Patrick Mahomes. Them lies you tellin' won't get past me. If it's meant to be, I'm not gon' ask for a second chance. I'm only gon' ask you once after that, then it's out my hands. I'm not gon' question, just accept it, part of God's plan.